our Father, and the heaven knows your name. Speak louder. Let this place hear up with praise. Can you hear it? The sound of heaven touching earth. The sound of heaven touching earth. Spirit break out. Break our walls down. Spirit break out. Break our walls down. Holy Spirit. Spirit break out. Holy Spirit break out. We need you. Oh, we need you. Break our walls down. Good evening friends and family i always say i don't want to be coming before you long but it's been a while since i've been on here and um i'm just caught coming on here today just to encourage you um we look for the blessing in god and we say that we want to be blessed and we say that we want to be prosperous but we don't do what it takes to for the blessing we don't want to do uh what it takes with deuteronomy um 28 says about if you do thus and thus so in your time and in your leisure when you get a chance try to read deuteronomy 28 and see the cycle of blessing that god is trying to take us in in this season and it's so important for us to know in this season what we're dealing with and what we're facing with you know we always want to say you know this is the end of the times this is the sad times this that but understand the season that you are in in your life in this season it is so important for us to know and just to hear God, to hear God for ourselves, to establish that relationship with him like as never before. It is so important for us to stay in the balances of what God is doing and stay in his remnant and stay in his alignment in this year and any other year. But it's important in this season that we know and that we hear from God as if to, we are making the right and the wrong choices in life. And like I said, we always look to God and we always say, you know, um, we're blessed. But are we really blessed to the magnitude that he really wants to bless us with? And it's not always about material things or monetary. You know, it's just even living our lives. You know, us waking up in the morning and just breathing. Um, just stepping into that next realm in him. Just understanding that we are in the right season. And we are in the right flow of God. And we are walking out the fruits of the spirit, which is in Galatians 5. You know, just doing everything according to his word. And just hearing him and obeying him with the relationship that we have with him and just during this the season of us you know just worshiping our, our lifestyle daily worshiping with him so we can hear him so we know where we're at in the seasons that we need to be in it is so important and i know even for me the going through this you know in the time that i am going through what i'm going through and it's all good it's victorious but just understanding the season that I'm in and just knowing that, you know, of course, your faith is going to be tested because you believe in, in, in the true and living God. And the enemy is upset about that. He don't want you to get anything, you know, that's great from God. But see, I know who I am in God. So I understand that in this season, it is okay for me to walk through what I'm walking through with God. And I know that the great end will be victorious to my life and I always looked at like I said earlier Deuteronomy 28 about the blessing and understanding what is a real blessing from God what is a real blessing from God and understanding what season I'm in in this time so saints I just want you you know to understand what season that you're in so you won't have to be anxious for nothing we understand the government uh, president and all that but we ain't talking about politics we talking about spirituality and understanding the season that we're in in this time and just give God all the praise and the glory I ain't come over here to try to judge anybody but just I just want people to understand and, I, and I'm just encouraging them to understand where we're walking at in this season it is so important 
and you be blessed on today. I love you all, and I'll talk to you soon. Grace and peace.